had to find a way to somehow convert VW's cut data into real-time data without changing the underlying structure. The combination of cat data with AI components really brings us to another level. A challenge considered by many is the holy grail of the automotive industry. The technology eases our pain when working with automotive CAD data and makes complex processes much, much simpler. Hi everybody, my name is Rick Pole and I'm the product owner for real-time CGI solutions at Volkswagen. Simplification in our complex industry is always in demand. We at Volkswagen are a very data-driven company. We generate massive amounts of data from initial design to production to assembly and marketing and sales. One single car might hold millions of different personalization and configuration options. Each car part that changes on the inside and outside of the car originates from a gigantic database, which again holds detailed information about size, function, identification number, and so on. When a customer configures a car in our configurator, he also defines the DNA of a digital twin, which is born right inside of our database. We call this car DNA PR configuration string. It is as unique as a digital fingerprint of every car model. Ever since real-time technology was able to render an image of our complex digital twins, we were searching for more and better ways on how to automate our production pipeline and to capitalize of our wealth of data. We got in touch with Pierre Grage from Unevis and discussed the pilot for real-time tool that enables designers without much CGI experience to create high-quality marketing images. I'm the co-founder of Unemis, a software development company from Hamburg, Germany. When VW approached us with the idea to use real-time technology in order to cut down post-production times of their digital marketing images, I was more than intrigued. We had to find a way to somehow convert VW's cut data into real-time data without changing the underlying structure. Yet cut data was never intended to run in real-time performance. A challenge considered by many is the holy grail of the automotive industry. In close collaboration with VW, Epic Games and Effect Etage, we developed a solution to this challenge called Solid Machine. Now, I'm happy to introduce you to Mirko Hensken, the architect of this amazing technology. When we started the collaboration with VW, we decided to use the Passat for our tests. Millions of different configurations for personalizations are possible with this car. CAD programs have been a standard in the automotive industry for decades. CAD files contain visual and technical information about each and every car part and thus are super complex. Too complex to make use of them in any real-time software. For the purpose of working with this data in a modern-day real-time engine, the CAD data has to be entirely simplified, restructured, regrouped and the appropriate metadata has to be extracted and assigned to the correct geometries optimized for real-time production. Solid Machine handles the error-prone and tedious process of real-time optimization automatically. Our AI routines will analyze the CAD data and check for errors and correct them wherever necessary. PR string metadata will be connected to the correct real-time geometry Wrong shader material or geometry names are corrected automatically by a fuzzy logic system and digital materials are getting segmented and automatically assigned to the correct real-time car part. Solid Slim automatically detects polygon errors and corrects them before the reduction process. Geometry parts can be categorized in reduction groups to not having the 3D operator making adjustments for the same kind of part over and over again. Artist tools like mask painting make it easy to guide the reduction algorithm where more detail needs to be preserved. Solid Slim works non-destructive. If you need more detail, you can adjust the reduction algorithm for each car part at any time directly within Unreal. And now, let me give you a quick demo of the results. Initially, an unoptimized configured car model of this Volkswagen Passat can have more than 40 million triangles and can easily lead to more than 8,000 draw calls. Importing and converting all car parts into the Unreal Engine may take up to several hours, especially for a complex model like this one. With Solid Machine, we have changed this process drastically. The fully automated importing process into the Unreal Engine for this model 
took not longer than 12 minutes, including automatic material setting. Since it's a fully configurable 130 percentage model, I can switch on all car models that I want for this blueprint. Here I switch in real time using configuration strings between a Volkswagen Passat R-Line and a Volkswagen Passat Variant R-Line. This Volkswagen Passat model was reduced by solid slim up to 65%, resulting in an average triangle count of 9 million and an average count of 1100 draw calls. The blueprint creation for this Volkswagen Passat model took less than a minute, including structure and geometry optimizations. In this example, I have loaded a Volkswagen Passat GTE. The model looks pretty cool to me and I could definitely use it in a real-time production right now. But I think some of the parts might benefit from a polygon reduction. We are able to do the reduction right here in the Unreal Engine without switching to a different DCC application. So let's say we want to go with one third of the old triangle count. Obviously, we are not able to use this first result in our production, but we can easily fix those holes with Solid Slim's tools. In this case, I use border masking to keep the outer edges as close as possible. All I need to do now is to bake this mesh into a new static mesh and I'm done. What you can see here is the original mesh with 81,000 triangles and there is the newly reduced mesh by Solid Slim with 25,000 triangles. The difference is hardly to see. With Solid Leap, we created an AI tool for artists. Leap analyzes the output of a material in a huge material library. This can be a picture of a car or a reference picture if you have one. We tell Leap to only look at the car paint shader and then Leap will analyze the reference picture and try to match it in Unreal. The AI does the same thing an artist would do, but it just tries out more variations in less time. It's a great tool to speed up the artist process and our first addition to our AI-powered artist tools for Solid Machine. Solid Machine and its AI tools help us to cut down production times and focus more on the beautiful images instead. The technology eases our pain when working with automotive CAD data and makes complex processes much, much simpler. Not only we were able to adapt the Unreal Engine into our production pipeline very fast, we are also able to produce movies entirely within the Unreal Engine that people thought we produced in classic DCC packages with compositing. The combination of Solid Machine and Unreal Engine give us a glimpse of the future of automotive content production. One of the most challenging tasks is getting the correct PR configuration string for multiple car configurations. But what do you do if you work at an agency that has to set up a bunch of different car configurations like a Passat variant with certain rims and certain colors? It's highly probable you don't know any of those PR codes. Nevertheless, you do need them because otherwise you won't see a thing. Or even worse, something that looks correct but isn't so. In the worst case, this can only be picked up weeks later by a product specialist. With Solid Meta, we learn all possible configurations of a car model while we are processing the geometry parts. Now I got a PR code for the British market. I used the car checking tools to put the PR code right here and switch the car. What happens now if I get a PR string that is not complete or contains wrong codes? Let's take this one. You can see here there's no car paint, no interior trim, no rims, and actually the car looks like it has been parking in the wrong neighborhood. In our system, you pass the PR string to Solid Meta and get the closest match to your car configuration from all the configurations our AI has learned so far. It picks the one that is closest to the string I have given it. In this case, it's the Volkswagen Passat Variant R-Line in white. We can now evaluate the configuration tokens that have been added by Solid Meta. And we are able to change each of the tokens in real time, seeing the effect right here in the Unreal Engine. But Solid Meta can do even more for you. Imagine you just have a couple of car tokens and you are searching for the closest match to those tokens. Here I have a token for the steering wheel on the left, one for the line and one for a certain rim. I can feed this information to the AI and get back the closest configuration possible for those tokens. Solid Meta shows you immediately which parts were missing and which parts it added. 
with a solid machine, we're going really the next level of car visualization. The combination of CAT data with AI components really brings us to another level. And I'm looking forward to see how we can save efforts and fasten up the processes. I think that's really the next big step in our business. Now, before we go on, there's something more we'd like to show you today. The very question that set us off on this path was the desire to basically do automotive post-production in real time. The development of Solid Machine enables us to do just that. And now I'm happy to announce today Solid Creator, our Unreal-based front-end solution for Solid Machine. In Solid Creator, everything you saw comes together and gives the user the power of Unreal and Solid Machine in one easy and simple to use interface. Solid Creator works right in your browser and it's so easy that it feels like playing a computer game while you're making great looking marketing pictures. Let me give you a sneak peek and show you how. Here we have loaded 130% Passat model in Solid Creator, our front end for Solid Machine. So let's say you want to change the configuration of a car. You can do that via the configuration tab. Let's say you want to change the car paint. For this, you open the paint tab. Now you see all the possible paint options for the current PR string that our AI has learned so far. You can change configurations easily with a click and do the same for the rims. To get a better view on how the rims look, I decide to switch the camera to the rim view. Now I play around with the options and see all my changes take effect in real time. I decide to go with the Bonville rim. To get a better view on how this change looks, I simply need to go through the cameras in the upper menu. The PR string adapts in the background and can be accessed at the bottom of the configuration tab. Now I want to have a closer look at the interior. I can do this via the camera menu again. In this example, we can choose between two interior angles and it is possible to create more camera views of course. For this car configuration, we learned one more interior option which I can choose from the interior menu with a simple click. To switch back to the exterior, I just need to select any other camera view. Thanks to Solid Machine's half-automated rigging system, we are able to implement animations into Unreal and view them right here in Solid Creator. I just need to open the Animations tab and activate the animations I would like to see. If I want to see the full animation, I simply click on the icon. For fine adjustments, I use the slider. Same works for the lights of the car. Let's say I want to pose the Passat a bit more dynamic. I switch to the rim view to get a closer look and adjust the wheels in the way I like. For the front left camera, I prefer the rims to be a bit more visible, so I turn them and close all doors again. 130% model is also sometimes referred to in the industry as 150% model. It simply means that such a car model holds all possible configurations for any market. In case of the Volkswagen Passat, this means that we can also switch to Passat variant at any time. To do this, we need to go to the settings tab and simply choose the car line we would like to see. Let's take the Passat GTE variant. The configuration change happens thanks to solid machine optimization so instantly that it makes you forget that we just switched thousands of objects in the background. For this PR string, our AI has learned some more configurations. I still like the car paint, but let's change the rim to Mondre. Let's take a look how the car looks from the back and turn in the wheels again for a better picture pose. Now let's say I want to change the country settings and switch to a right-hand drive car. To do this, I simply go to the configurations tab again and choose the market of Great Britain. Our AI gives you the correct market configurations. Here you can see the car paint and rim options it was able to find for the Passat estate. Now let's quickly jump inside to get a closer look at the right-hand drive car. As expected, the steering wheel is now on the right side, for which we would need to create a different camera view. solid icon on the upper left corner and choose new car from the drop down. Let's take the ID4 and choose a line. I decide to go with the family line. The AI has found 53 configurations. If I don't want to look them all up, I can use the search bar. The solid meta AI gives us the ability to search for any PR code that comes to mind. Let's try this with U60, which is a rim, or C7D, another rim. If you don't have a PR code handy, no problem. Besides any PR codes, you can also search for any names that Solid Matter has learned. Let's press the I feel lucky button to get a random configuration from the list. Honey yellow, nice choice. With the free cam, you can reframe the shot and save the angle for later. 
let's check some of these standard angles and see how the car looks. Okay, let's go inside the car where I can show you one last thing. Let's say I want to create a winter feeling inside the ID4. For this, I click on the background and environments tab where I can choose an HDRI image as a background. The light system will be a powerful tool where you will be able to create complex light situations yourself. For now, let's just lower the intensity a bit. Okay, now let's switch the angle one last time and enjoy the view. It was a great honor to work with Epic, BW and Effect Etage on this project. We would like to thank them for their trust. We can't wait to see what our clients will do with this new technology. Thank you for joining us. Stay well and have a great day.